With Korea Simulate 3.0, users will be able to open up models containing failed features. While it's always good practice to resolve failed features in a model, in some cases, in the process of simplifying a model for analysis, a number of features might be impacted due to child-parent relationships. In this case, removing a feature will cause others to fail. This enhancement will allow these models to be opened in Creo Simulate and analyzed. On the screen is a model containing a number of failed features. However, I can still open up this model in Creo Simulate. Immediately I am presented with a warning message indicating that the model has failed to regenerate. You can enter Creo Simulate with this model, run your analysis or standard design studies, and even view the results. However, you cannot run sensitivity or optimization design studies until regeneration failures are resolved. Let's click on OK. The failed features are still listed in the model tree. However, users will be able to define many of the traditional simulate features, such as forces, displacements, any of the idealizations, connections, surface or volume regions, etc. As specified, the only real limitation that will happen is when you want to run an analysis or design study. If I click on File, you'll notice that the new sensitivity design studies or optimization design studies are grayed out. While it's always good practice to resolve failed features, this enhancement will allow Creo Simulate users to continue analyzing their data.